Hey guys, Jeremy here out at Rockley, and I thought I might do a quick video on my current off-grid setup for my caravan. On Facebook Marketplace a few years ago, I got these three 80-watt panels, the cables to connect them, and this little unit here that has all you need to be a off-grid setup. So there was no battery in it, but it did come with pretty much everything there, plus this awesome controller. Um, I've added on some little USB plug-in lights uh, and other such things. This Makita uh, battery charger is also 12 volt. And so this is all running amazingly. 277 amp hours, like that is fat. 14.7, 14.1 volts. Uh, so yeah, we can see that um, 20 degrees, Outside, inside, 18 degrees outside. Gets cold here. Sometimes it'll get to minus six, we've seen it. Um, so that's what we're drawing at the moment. Um, 556 amp hours, woo! So you can see that, you know, this thing is definitely doing well, even on a cloudy day like today. But the fact is, I've got this battery rigged in parallel with these two batteries. So I've got three car batteries that I got from an auto electrician and I've rigged them all up together. I do have a fourth one that I could probably add, but at the moment I've got so much power, I don't really need the fourth one. I've got plenty of power to charge the batteries for the power tools, charge the lights, charge my phone. Um, you know, I can plug in anything we need here, like a laptop or something. Um, I do want to get a 12 volt kettle. That's probably next on the list. I have run the cable. Uh, so this one here goes to the outside solar panels. This one uh, plugs back into the caravan. So if I turn that on, then I can turn on the lights. There we go. But I rarely turn on the inverter, just because I have turned it, forgotten to turn it off a few times. And as such, I killed some expensive batteries, $400 batteries. Uh, so now I've got four batteries for... $100 instead of the 400 lithium ion batteries I had before. Anyway, you win some, you lose some, and you learn along the way. So this cable here runs now underneath the seat here and then pops out here to my uh, little 12 volt camping fridge. I'm really happy with the way this has worked out. It's filled in the fridge that was there before, had a Dometic, and that Dometic was uh, only gas and 240 volt. So I've just fitted out these little shelves here and finally fitted in a 12 volt fridge. So very happy with my current setup in my little caravan. I usually chuck a tank of water there. It's back in the car now. And uh, I get to come here and enjoy Rockley for all it's worth. If you're still watching, might as well zoom in on these plums here. Ornamental plums, but they are delicious. And they were just here at the remnant bushland. Mmm. The yellow ones too. And they're thick with fruit right now. I've got a fantastic harvest that I'll take back to Sydney, along with my little potato harvest and oregano. I don't expect to be getting much produce, but it's just a little bit of fun. There's the native pond. And I've got a little birdhouse we've put up. I checked it though, there's no birds in it yet. Maybe one day.